shared sense of, about China is building. The issues that divide us must not overwhelm the principles that unite us. Many states must see the strategic threat of building their digital future on Chinese infrastructure. They recognize the nature and magnitude of the risk posed by the Chinese companies harvesting data in service of the interests of the Chinese Communist Party. And like us, they abhor China's use of AI to supercharge surveillance, oppress minority groups, and impose ideological performance. For our partnership must be about a positive AI agenda. The AI futures that our partners yearn are not so different from what Americans seek. The development of AI could be a shared, shared endeavor, if you will, for a shared benefit. Research collaboration, pools of data to find, find algorithms, principles for employing AI tools ethically and responsibly all benefit from our collective thought and action. And this is especially true for democracies who need to be more united than we are. Uh, I visited India last year with Dr. Kissinger, and I continue to be amazed by the potential of your people and technology. India is a great partner today. It will be critical and a stronger partner tomorrow. India is a natural centerpiece of a coalition of democracies and a stronger bilateral partner. It possesses a thriving innovation economy, tremendous tech talent, shared democratic values, and a common interest in building a bulwark against authoritarianism in the Indo-Pacific region. Again, we have alignment here. The United States and India have a strong science and technology relationship. In the past two decades, countries have been working closely on cyber, on information and tech communications technology, and in other areas. And in each of these areas, the dialogue has expanded in terms of quantity and quality. The, the U.S. and India have also been partners in leading international forums around the development of, of this in, international normative and technical standards for AI and associated technologies, which is crucial for our development of all of this. Beyond the s and context, there are growing connections between the two nations, India and the United States, around our shared security concerns. There's something called the quadrilateral security dialogue among the United States, India, Japan, and Australia, which seems to be gaining strength. In October of this year, the nation's leaders met at the U.S.-India 2 plus 2 ministerial dialogue, where all the parties welcomed the elevation of this comprehensive global strategic partnership, which is vital in my view, and I think in the United States' view, to security and stability in the region and in the world. But we think that there is room to grow, and we believe that it's imperative that these nations work together to address these geopolitical challenges and rapid advances, advancements, if you will, in AI and emerging tech. 